This is code.org, and we are going to create a program that asks the user for a number greater than zero, then prints out a counter, starting at the uh, starting at that number and going down when it reaches when it reaches zero. Instead of printing zero, it prints blast off. Hey, it's a rocket launch. Okay. Yep. 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 Does this do anything yet? They gave us some code. Ooh, we entered a number eight, and nothing. Okay. Well, I'll call that a start. So, do this needs update at the at the start of a loop of the loop. Update the conditional statement for the wall loop. While the wall loop runs, as long as the counter is greater than zero. All right. So, at the start of the loop, we need to update the conditional statement. So it will run as long as the counter is greater than zero. And this is the condition, guys. So as long as this is true, the code in here will run. Well, right now it's just equal to counter. So it would be equal to eight with what I just did. Eight can't be true or false. The computer says, I guess that's false. You're not really asking a question. However, if I say, well, counter is less than eight, well, the computer can assess that, right? As long as whatever number I put in is less than eight, this is true and the code inside of it will run. Now, what they want it to be less than is not. They want it to be greater than zero. Cool. So that's done. Inside the loop, print the code. Inside the loop, add the code, prints the number in the countdown. All right. So we need a council log to output that. And this is our loop, right? Anything in this blue mouthfish thing will run repeatedly as long as that is true. So inside of it, right here, it says step two. Um, I'm going to print the code. Oh, I'll go up a line to follow it with the comments. So I'm going to print a counter, right? And so now I'll print out that number. If I hit run right now, guys, my computer might break. And that is because this would be an infinite loop. It would cause us some problems because right now counter is never going to change. So if I enter eight, well, eight is always greater than zero. I'd print eight, hit the bottom back to the top. Eight is still greater than zero. Print eight, hit the bottom back. And the computer would flip out. I need to make sure to decrease the value. Now I'm going to do that here. And what I'll do for this is I'm just going to go old school and say counter is equal to whatever counter used to be equal to minus one. So when the computer hits this, it says, okay, counter has a new value. What is it? It's counters old value, but I got to take away one and kapow, that will be the new value of our counter variable. So that should be set. And that way counter goes droop, down, 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 down. And then once say it, we start, I enter four and notice prompt number, enter number. When I enter that, that number gets saved there. We then continue to on down where four, if that's what I entered, the number uh, counter would be equal to four. Four is greater than zero, so we would drop in our wall loop. Council log four would print to the screen. Then counter, which is equal to four, has a new value. Four minus one is three. It would hit the bottom. Three is greater than zero and have to repeat because we're in a wall loop. Three is greater than zero. So now it prints three. Counter has a new value. Three minus one is two. Zoop. Two is greater than zero. Prints two. Two minus one is one. Zoop. One is greater than zero. Prints. Prints it. Counter has a new value. One minus one is zero. Zoop. Zero is not greater than zero. And now we need to pr output blast off. So let's go back to council. And I'm just going to write blast off. Tricky. All right. Let's see. Yeah, that looks good. Quip out. Uh, enter a number. I'm going to say four. Blam, blam, blam. Blast off. What if I do something higher? It will still work. Oh, this was a bad choice. Oh, oh, that if I speed it up. Cool. Hey, it's really good to get used to how these loops work. They're going to make our lives easier and you'll see. All right. Onward.